Are you tired of this happening while taming Calicatherium? My name's Stickwarsa, and today I'll show you how to tame a Calicotherium, and if you stick around, I'll tell you a couple of neat things about tamed Calicotherium. First off, let's prepare. The food you're gonna need in order from most effective to least effective. Beer. I'm not pulling your leg. The creature's a non-violent tame, which will only accept beer. At a default taming rate, a level 50 can take 11 minutes, a level 100 can take 17 minutes, a level 150 can take 25 minutes. Once tamed, you can't even force feed them beer. Their diet changes to a standard herbivore diet. Beer is made in a beer barrel filled with water, 50 beer, 50 berries, 50 berries, and 40 thatch. The water can come from either being irrigated from a water intake or being manually filled, but not from a non-irrigated water tank or a water well. This will create one beer liquid every six hours or one hour if you have single player settings enabled. Once you have beer liquid inside the beer barrel, you can remove it with a water jar. As a side note, any beer jars used in the taming of this creature will not return the water jar to you, so keep this in mind while you're preparing for the tame. This is one creature you do not want to upset, or if you do, it must be a calculated measure. Calicatherium hit hard and have various projectiles they can throw at you. As I said earlier, Calicatherium is a non-violent tame, so make sure you put your beer in the last slot of your hot bar. The most straightforward way to tame a Calicotherium is to follow it around and run up behind it every minute and a half or so and interact with it to feed it. The interval between the first and second feedings is always several times longer. After a few rounds, it should be tamed. If you're worried about the Calicotherium wandering away, they can be immobilized by a large bear trap. Knowing this, you can make a calculated attack to lure it into a trap. You need to make sure you reset their aggression before you attempt to tame. It's also imperative that you do not bump into them or get in front of them once they're in the trap and after you start the tame because they're aggressive to your structure. At this point, they're held in memory, so it's almost impossible to reset aggression if you're on a server. If you're playing single player, you can exit the main menu and come back to reset the aggression. If your settings allow for it, you can pick up a Calicotherium with a Wyvern or Quetzal and bring it back to a pre-built taming pen. As before, make sure you reset their aggression before you attempt to tame and try not to upset them once you start taming. Keep feeding the Calicotherium until it's tamed. If this video was helpful, make sure you like and share it. Your support really helps out the channel now for the neat facts that I promised earlier. The Calicotherium saddle can be learned at level 42 and crafted in a smithy with hide, fiber, and metal ingots. The primary attack is either a bite attack or a large swipe with the right arm if you're looking left. The secondary attack is a rock throw with a distance of around 12 to 13 foundation distance away on level ground. I want to pause here to note that this is highly dependent on the angle you fire the rock at. If you want max distance, you'll need to aim about 45 degrees upward like I showed here. 
If you aim straight on, you'll hit closer to five foundation distance away. The crouch button triggers a bite attack, which doesn't cause your Calicotherium to stop. Calicotherium can be put into a turret mode where it will lob boulders autonomously. While it has a shorter range than the catapult turret, it has the advantage of not requiring ammo. Creatures in turret mode will not feed from a trowel and must have food in their inventory. After some testing, I found that at five walls high, a Calicotherium will throw a rock at a target between eight and 13 foundation distance away, and with the target distance set to highest, they will lock onto targets from six and a half to 16 and a half but will not be able to hit their target. Of course, this does vary with the height of the tower. The height of the tower seems to be added to the range to a certain extent. This 10 high tower has a max range of 12 and targets from 10 to 18 and can't hit anything. They will also not attack flying targets. Calicotherium are also efficient at gathering berries, which gets even better by using their crouch attack while on the move. They're also pretty good at gathering thatch as well. Wait a second, those are the ingredients for beer. <laughs> Why am I just realizing this now? Whatever. The player can use equipment on the back of the Calicotherium. There's a corrupted form of the Calicotherium that first appeared on the Extinction map and is surprisingly unaggressive and cannot be tamed. That's all I've got for today. Thank you guys so very much for watching, and have yourselves a very good day.